Hey guys, so uh, I am in Denver this week and um, that's why my background looks the way that it does and uh, I have a palette review for you. I'm super excited about it. I had some certificates. I popped into Sephora on my way out of town and picked it up. Picked it up for a pick-me-up and um, it is gorgeous. I'm so excited about it and uh, I just wanted to do a review for you guys while it's all pretty and pristine and uh, you know before I start digging into it and stuff. So it is the Kat Von D Ladybird palette and uh, it's well it's called Ladybird but then it is also called True Romance eyeshadow palette. So I don't know. And then it, uh, so this is what it comes, this is what it looks like inside. These are the shadows, and they are all matte shadows, and I'm super duper excited about it. I can't tell you how excited I am. So there you go, and I hope that the colors are showing up nicely for you. I am limited on lighting right now. I do now. want to kind of talk about the packaging for just a second. It's, um, this is like plastic, but it's, it, no, I believe it's got some metal to it. And so it's got some weight, so it feels substantial. It's not heavy though, but I'm saying for the weight of the, of the material that it's packaged in, it's, it's got some heft to it. It's got a nice size mirror here for you. And, um, the shadows are just kind of placed in this little plastic and it's got the space for you to carry the liner in there as well. So I'm super excited. I can't wait to dig into this. I started to use it this morning when I was putting my makeup on and I said no. I want it to be nice and pretty for my video review. So I'll go through the colors for you. Um, it comes with a eyeliner pencil. I'll show you that first. And the eyeliner pencil is called Immortal Love and it's a brown. And I've never used any of Kat Von D's um, shadow, uh, uh, eyeliners before, but they seemed pretty creamy. I tested them out. These little ones like this are $10 at uh, Sephora and they have, she has all kinds of different colors, green, blue, brown. I mean, black, everything, gray, I think. So I'll go ahead and swatch this for you. And oh, it is pretty creamy. Goes on nice and gives a good line. So I do love this brown. This is a, a really good true brown and it's nice and deep. So I'm excited about that. That comes in the palette. And then the colors, and I'll do swatches for you guys as well. Okay, let's see. How am I going to hold that? There we go. Okay, so this first color here, which is a burnt orange color, it's a very beautiful. It's party. Okay, so that's burnt orange, and that's called Cleopatra. And then this next color, which is kind of a, a really pretty brown, but it's got some red in it, and that's called Wolf. And then this next color here, with a very light caramelly kind of brown color or you know tan color and that is called Harlow. Okay this next one is uh, it's one of my favorite type of eyeshadows because I feel like my lids are really dark so I like lighter colors like this to put on my lid and it's like a light peachy beige color. It's got, definitely got peach in it to me. And that is called Unrequited. And then this next one, bear with me, I'm not sure how to pronounce this. I believe it's Susie Sue. And that is a beautiful deep gray color. It's very pretty. And then this next one is called Rain Holder. And um, it is definitely like a taupey beige color. Very pretty. Oh, God, there I am with the very pretty crap again. I'm sorry. Okay. 
it's gorgeous how about that gorgeous okay and then this next color here is a highlight color it's got peach tone to it as well and it is called vespertine and then this last one for for elise if you're going to try to say it correctly it's german and it is um like a, a plum color it's very nice <laughs> very nice i love it i hope that you guys are having a good day and um thanks for watching i appreciate it and please like the video and subscribe uh, and come back and see me. So in the meantime, guys, I'll see you in the next video and be at peace. Bye.